Hello and welcome to a new series where I'm going to find out just how many chickens you can keep on a farm before the game crashes. Um, here I've just skipped through spring just to get myself a little bit of money. Um, we actually have a lot of fish to sell as well. I've just been fishing, mining, doing like the boring first month of a uh, first month of a new game kind of stuff. We are going to try our best to fill this entire normal farm with nothing but coops. Okay, here's the rules. We have to have over a thousand chickens, we have to crash the game, and we have to have fun. We started off in spring, I skipped through a little bit, this is just a montage. Then we have four, four plus one uh, big coop there just to start us off with. I thought, you know what, I'll incubate one egg myself. We've named them one, two, three, four, and five. We have five chickens on this farm. Uh, I got pretty unlucky here in the summer. I went to buy yet another coop. And I was like, it's a Thursday, why is Robin not, why is Robin not here? I uh, checked the wiki and I picked the only day of the year where she does not stick to her schedule. So that was pretty unlucky. Went to floor 100, got the star fruit, was very happy with that. Hit hit. Uh, then we just got ourselves yet yeah, another coop. We were just buying these as fast as we could. Signed up to Georgia just so I could get the bus quicker without having to hunt around for specific things. Hit floor 120, got that skull key. Uh, as you can see, we just kept on adding. Robin was getting very rich from us, let's put it that way. Got some iridium, put down a couple of these silos, and uh, just every every few days we would just buy another coop. We got the greenhouse before long as well. This montage is doing a good job just to sum up the first year. We're going to be taking it to year two in a second, but uh, yeah, we uh, made good use of the greenhouse. Covered that with forage from uh, fall, just to make the make the tea leaves, so we can sell that for a big, big markup. Also, I thought let's get some uh, star fruit in here as well. We eventually started making star fruit wine. Um, this was a big money maker early on, and uh, I was very happy that we always had more money than we were spending. Doing lots of skull cavern runs just for money for iridium, just to get iridium sprinklers. Started off with a rain day, and here we are. Okay, we're up to date. We're up to date now. Um, year one, I just montaged there. We're going to go through year two a lot, lot more uh, in depth. Here we have, I forget how many it is now. I think it's like 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. I put these two close together, so I'm going to move this one down one. Uh, 18 chicken coops um i think we're aiming for like to get 1200 chickens i did the maths earlier uh we're gonna need 1200 chickens this is just 18 and these are just all single coops apart from this which is a big coop they all need to go to big coop and then they all need to go to deluxe coop so this is gonna be if you solely look at it it's like uh just getting robin to upgrade one takes every few days to do that three times on every single slot on the map this is gonna be this is a serious project here currently uh, we have five chickens because i thought there's no point in me continuously buying chickens that's money that i could be spending on coops chickens can come later let's just uh we have no food for them anyway um let's just make the chicken coops and then we will uh, worry about buying the chickens afterwards and worrying about buying the chickens afterwards is something that I have on my mind because 1,000 chickens at 800 gold each uh, that is a lot of money that is a lot of money um, I mean we're going to be going maybe over a million in chickens wait a minute it's Tuesday I don't understand. Why is Robin here on a Tuesday? I was waiting outside because normally she's in bed and I have to wait for her to come down. Robin is what? Does Robin work the first Tuesday? I had no idea. Robin is always off on a Tuesday. Does she work the first Tuesday of each year? I have no idea. We don't have enough wood, uh, but while I'm here, let's just move one of these. Because I did not leave a little gap in between. There we go. So I'm having like a little lane going in. So all the chickens from all the way up here, all the way down here, 
all the way across the map can all funnel together into this one central area that I'm just going to pack with grass. Okay, um, I can't buy seeds today. I keep forgetting to buy seeds. I've got 279 fibre, a bunch of wood, and 183 fall seeds, which uh, I was growing for a long time. Didn't bother with the winter seeds, just thought, let's just fucking keep with, this, keep with the fall seeds. And to make a tea sapling, you need two seeds of any kind, five fibre and five wood. So let's just burn through all this fibre, or wood, whatever comes first. 55, which you might not think is that much, but... 55 times blah, 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 blah. 55 times 500 is actually not bad. 55 times 500. I don't know what that is. Well, let's find out. It's going to be a whole lot though. Yeah, that's not bad. That ain't bad. 27,000. I'll take that. Um, so today we need to go to Piers and buy probably cauliflowers. Um, okay. Turns out Robin is not done yet. She is still hammering away. Um, let's get a little bit of pathing down here, just so we can know where the, uh, where the, where the lines are that we have to, we can make sure we don't go over anything. Get rid of that thing, first of all. Get rid of these little saplings that are blocking the way. Um, we're going to need to keep one line clear because the, the coops are like here. They need some space to come out and walk along into the grass area every day. I'm sure this is going to crash the game. I'm sure it's going to crash the game. Let's see. Any starfruit? Probably tomorrow. Probably tomorrow on the starfruit. Let's just put our uh, remaining seeds and shit away. Four fiber. 73 seeds. Fall seeds. I just had this place covered in fall seeds. I just slept, slept, slept. Picked them up. Done them again. Uh, but yeah, Seeds is the name of the game, and we're going to go and see our boy Pierre. Good news and bad news. Good news is I got a bag upgrade. I can now cycle through three lines of shit. Uh, bad news is we didn't... I didn't do the calculations well. Um, I kind of thought, yeah, this is a, this is more than enough cauliflower. But we're kind of we're kind of missing a little bit. Um, we're going to get the starfruit tomorrow, hopefully. And another coop. Oh yeah, these guys did the minecarts. I forgot, I bought the minecarts. Just to make it easier to go to the mines and get the, uh, get the fibre. Yeah. Okay, so this is number, like, 15 now? I've lost count. I've lost count of how many of these we've got. Um, just gonna get rid of the grass on the outside, because we want to keep the chickens central. Okay, so here's the thing for how I get so much fibre. Just come to level 80 of the mines, take the ladder... And it's almost always like this. Almost always uh, just absolutely filled. And I mean filled with uh, with weeds. But I'm not sure why that is. But this is where I go. And I just do this. Like you can see it's nearly, nearly midnight. Um, I've just been doing this pretty much the whole day now. Just checking in, checking out of floor number 1881. Uh, sometimes go down another one just to check. Pick up a little cave carrot action. How much are we making? Good about there. Good about there. 36 grand. We're just making more money than we can spend each day now. Uh, which is really good. Uh, hopefully today. Rainy day. Hopefully today we're going to have... There's Robin down there. Working working hard. Hitting that post like no one else can. Hopefully today is going to be starfruit day. It is. Nice. I'm going to harvest all these starfruit. And then we're going to sell the gold quality ones, pickle the rest, and then uh, I think I'm just going to spend a few weeks just cutting wood, calling on Robin from time to time, replanting starfruit, and uh, we'll see you back here at the end of summer. Okay, so we've got the first big harvest here. Can I get the rhubarb yet? Rhubarb must be tomorrow, but we have got a lot of cauliflowers. And they're not going to get pickled. We don't have enough jars. We don't have any kegs still yet. Uh, hopefully after today. I think, is our farming level at 10 yet? Um, farm level is at 10, so we can make kegs. I just have absolutely zero. I mean zero, uh, was it? Oak resin. I do have a couple of oak trees up here that I've tapped up. But sadly, I seem to have cut down every tree on the map. And I've got uh, no way of getting any oak resin. So I'm just waiting for those to give me some oak resin. Then the kegs are going to are gonna come. But these 
all these cauliflowers are just going to be sold. And we don't actually have enough time to plant any more. So we're going to plant probably potatoes instead. Uh, there we go, there's Robin there. Uh, I'm unsure how many we actually own now. But this many's. This many's. Um, yeah, soon I'm going to break out the calculator and find out just how many coops I have. Uh, sorry, how many coops are going to fill my farm and then double that number to get how many big coops and then triple it to see how many large coops. And then, after all that, we are going to need to see how many spaces uh, we can get chickens in. So, times whatever that final number is by 12. We are going to be looking at a lot of chickens. A lot of chickens. The, the bus is a little bit earlier. Us closed on a Wednesday! Oh! Why not? Why not? We close the door, Pam's on the outside. The bus drives away, Pam's... What is going on with this bus? Anyway, I'm going to replant, plant, replant. And this time I will see you at the end of spring. Okay, so I lied. Um, I am back before before summer. For one reason. I need to pick. Coopmaster or Shepherd? Befriend barn animals quicker. Well, we're not going to have any barn animals. Befriend coop animals quicker. Okay, this one. Incubation time cut in half. Now, that means that I might not have to buy all my chickens. I could easily just place eggs in the incubators and that could save a lot of money. We'll need to see how the money situation is after buying all the coops, then renovating them all to big coops, then renovating them all again to deluxe coops. Um, but regardless, this, this could be a huge time and money saver. Oh, also I made like 100,000 in the jellies and shit. Okay, it's the last day of spring, and uh, we are gonna we're gonna harvest what we've got. Um, we have a whole lot of uh, chicken coops now. I uh, went to the mines, got a lot of stone. I've been harvesting a lot of wood as well. The amount of wood you need in order to make all the kegs, all the uh, preserve jars, all the coops. Uh, I've been cutting down a ridiculous amount of trees. Now it's time to harvest all the kale. I plant kale instead of potatoes just because I was thinking they take the same amount of time. It's just kale cost more, so I'm guessing kale sells for more. Um, I'm not going to pickle them or uh, put them in a keg if you even can, uh, simply because the kegs are just from a star fruit and when I get the major fruit. Uh, I have a couple of seed makers now as well, so I will be uh, self-sufficient in that, that way as well. Won't need to buy any more seeds, as far as the uh, star fruit goes. Anyway, uh, hopefully, going to be making a whole bunch of star fruit wine. Uh, nothing to plant here. That's just going to be left. I'm get tomorrow. Well, in the next video, I will be having to hoe all this back up again, which is going to be a nightmare. I should probably upgrade my hoe actually. But yeah, what we're going to sell is 52 gold kale, 82 kale, 72 silver kale. Very happy with that. We will take our iron as well. Uh, we'll just put that away for now. Just want more iron so I can make more kegs. Uh, the only thing I'm waiting on is the... Oh, these grew. I'm waiting on some more uh, oak resin. And we'll make two more tapos as well. Uh, right here. I kind of like to have this as my craftable stuff. All my metals, my ores. Right next to the furnaces there. And let's just get these tapped up here. We need a lot of oak resin. A lot. Uh, yeah. How many have we got here? Well, we'll check at the end. We'll check at the end when we do our little screenshot to leave with. Um, the jellies. The jellies are ready. So we'll take out the star fruit and reload all of these. We're going to make a good bit of money. Uh, I'm making, I mean, making money isn't the uh, the objective here. The objective is solely just um, get chickens. Literally, just get chickens. But in order to get chickens, I have had to have had to like make a bit of money on the side just to uh, just to finance the purchase of all these chicken coops. I am single-handedly making Robin a millionaire. That's actually a good point. Robin and Marnie will both be billionaires because of me. I didn't think about that beforehand. Uh, but yeah, Robin and Marnie are making a whole lot of money off of me 
in this season. We are gonna go and see Robin now that we have enough wood. And do you know what we're gonna get? Let's get another chicken coop. I'll replant these just around about here. And let's take a coffee and go see Robin. Let's get another chicken coop on the go. Construct farm building. Let's take one of these things here, right in the middle here. Always like, put it, see how close it goes? Just, I'm pointing at the screen, literally touching the screen you can't see. Uh, but yeah, you can see the, the red line on the screen, which means, you know, the can't build here. So you just go one back, and then I can see it can go there, but we won't be able to get out the door. So let's move it up one more. Perfect placement. Um, that's how I've been doing it. Just been like leaving between each of the uh, coops, leave one gap just so the chickens can all come out. Okay, we do have a couple more oak resin here as well. Uh, just gonna yeet these off the tree. These are gonna be pretty nice to make another couple of kegs. Um, kegs are gonna be the way forward. Well, we're missing copper. Another two kegs. There we go. Put that back. Run out of coffee. Let's just grab another coffee. So yeah, you can see when you come down here, you can walk in between all of these. So when the chickens come out of their little uh, hatch here, they can just come straight out and into the grasslands. Where these chickens are loving it already. Those grasslands are going to be filled with well over a thousand chickens by the end of this series. Um, right, let's put one, two down there. I'm going to keep one of these back. Um, and eventually the same with one of these uh, preserve jars as well. Keep one back and put it in your house. And put it on the same day so that way you know when your, uh, when your wine is ready. So let's just load these up. And we'll keep one back. I think that's going to do it. We are, will look, we'll take one more screenshot. First we'll put this in the house. Uh, nothing much in the house, literally just the bed. Uh, but we'll put this here. Well, if we are going to sleep multiple days, uh, we can just wake up. And if we see this one is ready, then we know the ones in the greenhouse are ready. So we can have a harvest. Um, but before we leave, I'll leave you with a screenshot. Okay, here we can see our wonderful farm. I mean, we do have quite a lot. We do have quite a lot already. Uh, I don't know how many, let's see. So we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. And 26 is uh, underway just here. Robin will be working on that tonight. So that's effectively 26 bought and paid for. Uh, we have upgraded one to a big coop. Um, so if this is... I reckon we've got about a quarter. Maybe, a, yeah, I'd say about a quarter. We could fit this, like, up here. Uh, but we would have this bit filled in as well. Um, maybe just under a quarter. So if that's 25... If that's 25, maybe that's even less than a quarter. But we'll just say, just for argument's sake, say that's a quarter. Is that's a nice round number. Uh, so we can work out that it would be a hundred, a hundred of these coops. So let's get the calculator. So with the calculator, we can go, um, was it 100 times, um, well, we've already paid, we've already paid for, we've paid for 25. So it'd still be 75. So 75 times 4,000, which is the cost of, uh, buying a coop. 300,000, it's not that much. 300,000 to completely pave this, if if this is a quarter, with nothing but coops. Uh, so then when we get the big coop, uh, once we have 100 of the normal coops, to upgrade to the big coop would be 100 times 10,000. So 10,000, I think I know the answer, but let's just be sure. Uh, don't look like an idiot. Times 100 equals a cool mill. Um, so that would be... 1,300,000, 1.3,000,000 so far just for the, just to get all the coops and then upgrade them to big coops. And then after that, we would need to do 20,000 per coop. So it'll be an extra uh, 20,000 times 100, which would be 2 million. 
So it would cost us 3.3 million in just coops if, if this is a, this is indeed just a quarter. I think this is less than a quarter. Less than a quarter of the screen. I mean, we could fit it up here, um, in this quarter here, but we do have all this empty space, and there won't be empty space in the middle. It'll just be solid here, solid here, solid here. Uh, so we're probably going to be over that, but just for a round number, 3.3 .3 million still to spend just on coops. So Robin is getting, on top of which we've already paid Robin, she's getting an extra 3.3 .3 million. And then there comes in Marnie. Marnie wants her cut. Um, so let's say 100, 100 coops uh, times by 12 chickens per coop equals 1,200. 1,200 chickens and each chicken each, each chicken each, costs 800. So Marnie is going to take from us just under a million. Just in buying chickens from Marnie, it's going to set us back uh, 960 grand. And when we uh, add that to the 3.3 .3 million. Yeah. The total cost from now until us being finished with this project is going to be at least, at least 4.26 million. Um, but yeah, this is what we have right now. There we are. The size of us. Um, yeah. Uh, I'm going to just continue going round. I think I'm going to go round in a, like a circular motion. Although I'm going to leave this farmland uh, as it is uh, for now. We will put the last chicken coops in this area here. Solely because I want to keep this as farmland. Just to keep some extra money ticking over. We'll probably put ancient fruit there once we get it. Uh, and just have that. Um, we're probably going to do this as like one year per episode. That we started off doing like a year and the spring. So next next episode out it might just be summer, autumn, winter, might be longer, who knows. And uh, this is this is my idea. Not doing this with any mods or cheating or naming myself after the code for prismatic shard or anything like that. Uh, I want to do this completely legitimately. I want to crash my game with my rules and we are doing this from scratch and we are filling up every spot with a chicken coop. And each chicken coop with 12 chickens. And we're going to fucking crash the game. 